was in for a day Got covered with some gooey ooze That changed my DNA Now I try to act normal Keep my cool My other kids play after school I turn into a prehistoric hero I'm in Today on Dino Squad. Five ordinary teenagers become five extraordinary dinosaurs. But can they learn to work together in time to stop the villainous Victor Velocity? Go Dinos! You made it this time, Fiona, but you broke three rules to do it. No skates on school grounds, and no food in class. That's only two. Littering, three. Sorry, Ms. Moynihan. Settle down. Don't forget, we'll be taking a field trip tomorrow to the tide pools, and I'll need your release forms. Yesterday, we were discussing how many animals, rather than living alone, live in groups or colonies to survive better. You could call this self-interest. But some life forms, such as ants, will sacrifice themselves for the good of the colony, and wolves will instinctively place themselves between their newborn and a threat. These traits are vital to the survival of many species, something from which even we can learn a lesson. I think you'll enjoy working at Raptodyne, Peter. Thank you, Mr. Velocity. I'm sure I will. What is this place? It's where my real work is done. These nanomachines you developed will help speed up the process of perfecting my experimental DNA, the one I intend to use to genetically reconstruct all life forms and turn them back into what they rightfully should still be, dinosaurs. Is it? So, Peter, do you want to join me and be part of the dominant species? Or stick with the humans and go extinct? I got into business to swim with the sharks, not be eaten by them. I'm in. Welcome to the team. All right, let's break into our usual lab groups. You have two hours to identify as many species as you can find. And remember, if you work as teams, you'll get a lot more done in a lot less time. Team Shmeem. I'm here to check out all the cool creatures, not be a poster boy for cooperation. Okay, let's do this. Fiona, Buzz, and Caruso will find them. Roger, you identify them, and I'll write them down. Got it? <laughs> Come on, guys. Is anyone paying attention? Not to you. Buzz, help me out here. Get real, Jock. If I wasn't stuck in this class, I wouldn't even talk to a species like you. It's all good. I got it covered. Did a little surfing on the net last night. Printed out a list of sea creatures. This is a sushi menu. Sushi, fish, species, what's the difference? Speaking of species, we're all gonna be Biologicus Flunkimus if we don't get our act together and work as a team. Speak for yourself, I've got my act totally together. <laughs> With an emphasis on the act. Oh man. <clears throat> hey, stop slobbering up my new jacket, you ugly mutt. <laughs> Hey! Get back here! Whoa! Come back, Mutt! Hey, Fleabag! You forgot my jacket! 
Who cares about your stupid jacket? The poor thing's in trouble. Let's go rescue him. Dogs aren't a part of our assignment, Fiona. Oh, I hate it when sand gets in my underwear. Forget it. I'll do it myself. Come on, guys. Let's help. Are you gonna save the mud, too? No, I'm gonna save my jacket. Oh, well. Last one in is a rotten egg. That's you, eggplant head. Hey, come on, cut it out. Everyone into the water. Ah! Come on, boy, I got gotcha. you. Thanks. Shark! Shark! Hey, man. It ate your jacket. Give me that. I thought I made it clear no one was to go in the water. It was Fiona's idea. To save the dog. Well, I suppose working together to help an endangered creature is an acceptable excuse. Now, get back to work. Showers, Max. Caruso, you're in. Hustle up! Get out here! <laughs> Young man, in case you haven't noticed, this is a library. <laughs> Sorry. What? Oh, man! First that stupid mutt ruins my jacket, and now look what the dry cleaner did to my new one. Buzz, will you stop wasting your life away with those ridiculous video games? Sure, whatever, Mom. Huh? You know why you all failed the tide pool assignment? Because shrimp tempura is not a species? No, because you weren't a team at all. You were just five... <laughs> <laughs> Huh? I know what you're hiding. We're not hiding anything. Right, guys? Yeah. Not a thing. Nope, not Nothing us. to hide. I saw your claws, Max. And your tail, Fiona. You have a tail? All I got were these saggy arm thingies. They're pteranodon wings. And yours are stegosaurus spinal plates. No way. It's just a little breakout. Isn't it? I wish it was that simple. But the truth is, you've all been infected with virulent dinosaur DNA. How do you know all this? Who are you? I had a feeling that would be your reaction. All of you, hold hands. So, telepathically, we can all see together. 65 million years ago, an asteroid struck the Earth, wiping out all the dinosaurs. except for two velociraptors. Over time, their genes mutated, and they gained the ability to adapt their form. You're a velociraptor. You're like a vicious carnivore. I evolved beyond that long ago, but I'm afraid another raptor didn't. He's become Victor Velocity. How's that possible? The guy's a civic leader. Yeah, he owns that big biogenetics company in Boston. 
Raptor die. Because they dominated the Earth for hundreds of millions of years, far longer than man's short history, Victor believes dinosaurs are superior. What do you believe? That humans gained dominance because brute force lost out to reason and love. That's why I parted ways with Velocity long ago. But now, global warming and modern technology have allowed Velocity to improve his primordial ooze to the point that it can mutate human and animal DNA into dinosaurs. We're dinosaurs? How cool is that? But I don't want to be a dinosaur. I want to be a quarterback. This is much more important than fulfilling your personal desires. It's about saving the world. Can you cure us, Ms. M? Yes. No! Buzz is right. We gotta work together and stop Victor Velocity. How are you going to stop him? You can't even do a lab project together. I say we give our dinos a test drive. I want the cure. I, I want to be, be famous. A video game I say hero. we try it out. Enough! <laughs> I can't afford the advanced technology Velocity has, but I've managed to monitor his activities and impede him whenever I can. That's all great, Ms. M. But can we get started? Of course. This is the DNA chiller. <gasps> Relax, it won't hurt. The nitrogen will force the mutant DNA to the surface as it seeks warmth. This is the devolver. It will vacuum the frozen DNA for safe storage. That's it? That's it. Thanks. Come on, Fiona. Let's go. Oh. I thought we were cured. So did I. Research log entry 13 Alpha. Satellite scanners have located a mutant megalodon, approximately 10 meters in length. Somehow the DNA nucleotides have been fused by gamma contamination. Your DNA is not like any other I've seen in Velocity's experimental mutants. Something's contaminated it. I'm afraid I can't cure you. What? How am I supposed to live constantly changing into a dinosaur? It'll be all right, Max. How? I can show you how to control your new abilities so that you can become dinosaurs at will. This is the sea spirit calling Kittery Lighthouse. Either we've got a new species of whale in Kittery Harbor, or the Loch Ness Monster is lost. Probably just a humpback, Ollie. But call me back if you see any mermaids. <laughs> I sure will. It's a mutant megalodon. And it's headed for the marina. Miss Moynihan, you have to stop that thing. I can't do it alone, and neither can you. But if the five of you can think beyond yourselves, perhaps we can stop it together. Guys, let's go send that monster back to the Jurassic era. No, it's no more a monster than any of you. It's just a wild animal trying to survive. You have to save it, not harm it. How are we supposed to do that? With these. The DNA chiller and the devolver. Fiona, take the DNA chiller. As long as that mutant megalodon's genes haven't been contaminated like yours, it'll do the trick. And I'll take the devolver. Can 
I borrow that when you're done? My bedroom's a mess. I'll track you on my scanner and do my best to get in Velocity's way. Take the Dino Hydro for you. Good luck. Without noticing, dead ahead. As soon as he shows his overbite, you chill him, I'll spill him. to work as a team. Fiona, you're on the varsity swim team, right? Are you willing to dive in after that chiller? No problem. Buzz, get that de-oozer thing. Caruso, Roger, and I will trap the mutant. Go Dinos! form Spinosaurus is in the harbor. This could only be a result of my experimental DNA. Or... supposed to hurt it. Trust me, go Dino! Let's get the net. What now? Pump fake on three. One, two, three. Get prehistoric. Video games isn't a complete waste of time. You ooze, you lose. Did you see the way I duped that monstrous mutant? You? What about me? Hold it. What about all of us? Max is right. The real reason you were able to return that shark to its natural state without harm to you or it is because you finally worked as a team. 
and I'm proud of you all. Thanks, Ms. M. We couldn't have done it without you. You're the man. Er, the woman. And in Kittery Point last night, several frenzied residents reported seeing dinosaurs at the marina. But authorities report it was Tony Fine's promotion for a dinosaur of a tire sale. Look at that. Just a big balloon. Actually, Caruso, if you think about it, they're not too far off. You are full of hot air. It won't be long before I know all the details of my new dinosaur friends. <laughs> Today on Dino Squad, will Caruso's quest for fame lead him to unmask his secret dino identity on national television? Experiment 647.23A. At 1100 hours, I'm administering primordial ooze, batch 017-23, into the storm drain system of Manchester, New Hampshire, in order to evaluate the rapidity of flow and dispersion. Tracking the ooze indicates it is moving faster than anticipated, and its viability seems to be diminishing at an alarming rate. Take the truck south, then east, following these coordinates. Hurry! Caruso, just what is your designer jeans wearing backside doing sitting in my chair? Whoa! Roger, don't sneak up on me like that. And what were you doing on the computer? You know the rules. No using my equipment without permission. I wasn't on the computer. Yeah, you were. Look, you've changed all the settings. Probably downloaded viruses that'll take forever to fix. Why were you looking at a satellite map of Manchester, New Hampshire? Oh, that. Uh, well, yeah, I was looking for uh, dino mutants, save the world, national security, all that stuff. I don't see any signs of... Whoa! Hold the miniature cell phone. I don't believe I'm going to say this, but you were right, Caruso. Trace elements of primordial ooze. And I'll bet you your last tube of fancy hair gel that where there's primordial ooze, there's going to be dino mutants. Let's go with this bad boy. It sweeps the ooze so you don't have to. It'll pick up any extra primordial ooze that happens to be lying around. That's a good boy. Coochie coochie. Ah! Gross! Get that little guy. It may have ooze on it. Whoa! Look out, gang! Run! Let's put these things on ice. Don't let them get away. My calculations indicate that they're growing at an exponential rate. Go Dino!
I'll get him. Go Dino! Hang on, little one. Disgusting creature. Go on, little guys. Go play or do whatever it is you do. Yeah, go, go away, nasty things. We should sweep the area for any more primordial ooze or dino mutants. Report in if you find anything. Yo, Caruso. Some place else you need to be? Me? No. No place. I'm fine. Well then, get searching. Let's see. If I go this way and up, should be just around the corner. Ah! It's just me, Caruso. Did you check everything down this way? Absolutely. Did you investigate that dark culvert back there? Well, of course I did. Do you think I'd say I checked if I hadn't checked? I checked! Don't blow a gasket, Caruso. I was just asking. Um, I gotta go check another drain up there. I'll... I'll be right back. Well, unless one of us missed something, I'd say it's all clear. Good work, guys. Wait, where's Caruso? I don't know, but he's acting strange today. It's Caruso. He's always strange. No, today he's being strange even for Caruso. I think we better find him, which will be no problem, thanks to yours truly putting location finders in each of our watches. Geek, and ye shall find. <laughs> Yo, Caruso, what are you doing? Nothing. Who, me? Nothing. Then why are you standing in this line? What line? There isn't any line. The line that stretches all the way around the block? Oh, that line. Yeah, sure. I'm in line. It's, uh, well, it's a blood donor line. I'm standing here to give blood. That's it. It's a blood donor line. I'm giving blood. Whoa. Bad idea, dude. You got dino DNA in your system, remember? You can't donate blood. Right, yeah, well, I wasn't actually planning on donating blood. I was just waiting to see if, if they had any extra cookies and juice for people that were standing in line and wanted some. Look, guys, you can go now and leave me alone because I can positively, absolutely assure you that there is nothing going on here at this theater that you need to worry about. Okay, Caruso, let me get this straight. You're at a theater, last in line of about a thousand people. My calculations indicate, given spatial variance and a 5% error ratio, that Caruso is last in line of 2,332 people. Just to let you all know, this is the end of the line. Nobody else will be able to audition. For? The you famous TV show. The reality television talent show where anybody can audition and become famous? That's the one. This is as far as the line goes. Caruso, you lied to us. You just looked us in the eyes and lied. Caruso, have you ever heard what Sir Walter Scott said? Oh, what a tangled web we weave. When first we practice to deceive. What does that mean? Tangled web? Like the internet the web? Or... Is it about spiders or something? What it means, Caruso, is that if you lie, it creates the need for more lies and more lies to cover up your original lies until you're caught up in your own web of lies. And it always ends badly for the person doing the lying. Oh. But you don't need to worry. Everything's under control. OK. What are you going to do on stage? I'm, uh, I'm going to sing. <laughs> Experiment 647.23A, continuation. 
Primordial Ooze Batch 017-23 has completely dissipated in strength and faded to nothing. Most vexing. Hmm. Satellite sweeps are picking up a strange ooze signature at the initial location. I'm picking up a possible mutant signature. Turn around, now! I gotta say, I don't remember you ever singing. Not ever. Thank goodness, the end of the line. Wait! No pets allowed! It's okay, he's with us. And he's had all his shots and everything. <sighs> Sorry, I meant the dog. We don't do animal tricks. Look, if you're not auditioning for the You Famous show, you can't be here. Don't wait up, guys. The next time you see me, it's gonna be on TV in front of a crowd of adoring fans. <laughs> Whoa, we've got two alerts. One, seems like we missed a dino mutant. It's on the move. And two, is coming right at us. Victor Velocity! Fiona, get us out of here. Hurry, Fiona, we can't let him see us. Not good, not good. Keep your seatbelt on, Buzz. I'm already on it. We've got to get Caruso out of there. Um, guys? Velocity's parked right in front. Where there's a wheel and overhead satellite photos plus downloaded theater schematics, there's a way. The quickest way in, if you're a dino morphing dino squad, is straight up. Buzz, if you will do the honors. Go dino! an act? I have seen that act a thousand times. Today. Boring! Get off the stage! Get off! I'll definitely be something she's never seen before. A perfectly handsome young man becomes dinosaur? Dinosaur man? Handsome dinosaur man? It's going to be all over the place. Everybody will know me. Fame time. Dino man. Dino. Next! Look, Bobola, in the past few hours, I've been through 2,331 other potential contestants, each more untalented than the last. So you had better knock my proverbial socks off. Huh? Oh, no, not another one. <sighs> oh, right, your socks. Well, you'd better hang on to them because this is going to be something you've never seen before. Here goes. Fame, 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 fame! Caruso, have you ever heard what Sir Walter Scott said? Oh, what a tangled web we weave when first we practice to deceive. Look at that. A spider web. A web. Is that it? You done? Yes. I mean, no. Look, I'm sorry, Ms. Simone. I, I just can't. Obviously, because you... Yes, you are losing me from your show. That has got to hurt. Um, I know it's heartbreaking, but aren't you overreacting just a little? Sucker's getting big. This should help. Cockroaches can't see in red light.
Thanks, Max. Time to go dino! Over here, there's a big spider web. We can trap him in it. That's holding him. Not surprising. Spider silk has a tensile strength comparable to that of high grade steel. Sweet. An arachnid saurus. Can I keep him? No, Buzz. You cannot keep the mutated spider. It's those perfect dinosaurs. They're. they're here. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta set you guys free. I'd like to keep you as pets, but I don't think that would make my mom too happy. Tell me you got that on videotape. I did! The video camera was running the whole time! It's been erased! But how? <laughs> I left them a little gift on the side of the video camera. An electromagnet. Because as brainiacs like me know, videotape is a magnetic recording. And my magnet just rearranges all the low magnetic sequencing that creates image, or static. Well, I don't understand anything about what just happened. Perhaps I can help. I am a doctor, and I'm afraid I must tell you that all I saw was this fire curtain fall. Must have been loose. There are no such things as monsters or giant cockroaches. I suspect that with the lights and the dark and the long day, you didn't quite see what you thought you saw. It could have been a rare type of fatigue-induced group hypnosis. I'm sorry. Well, I am supposed to be cutting back on coffee. Yes. It's probably something to do with that. Why is it I cannot track those dinosaurs? They don't show up on any of my scans, but they're so perfect. I must find them. I must, wherever they are. I wanted to tell you, I didn't get a chance to sing. Oh, sorry, Caruso, but, you know, that's kind of good because, well, I know it's silly, we thought maybe you were just going to go on that program and go dino so you could be famous. Well, yeah. That's exactly what I was going to do. See, football? I told you. Now pay up. We bet dessert that you were going to go dino on TV to be famous. Maxi here thought you weren't. Sucker. I didn't, though. I changed my mind at the last minute. I couldn't go through with it. I... I... saw a web. A tangled web. And it made me think about what I was doing. So I didn't. I'm... I'm sorry I lied to you guys. But I've been thinking, maybe I could still be famous. I could learn to sing and be famous. Funny how that's just what Professor Moynihan said when we called and told her all about it. I've been singing for hours. Isn't there an easier way to be famous? If you want to sing, you have to sing. It's just that simple. Mime Mamomu, 
Me a mamo moo. Me me mamo moo. Me me mamo moo. Me me mamo moo. Maybe I'd better call Caruso's parents and tell them he's going to be late for dinner. Dog, the way he sings, he's going to be late for a lot of dinners. Today on Dino Squad, will Caruso's quest for fame lead him to unmask his secret dino identity on national television? Experiment 647.23A. At 1100 hours, I'm administering primordial ooze, batch 017-23, into the storm drain system of Manchester, New Hampshire, in order to evaluate the rapidity of flow and dispersion. Tracking the ooze indicates it is moving faster than anticipated, and its viability seems to be diminishing at an alarming rate. Take the truck south, then east, following these coordinates. Hurry! Caruso, just what is your designer jeans wearing backside doing sitting in my chair? Whoa! Roger, don't sneak up on me like that. And what were you doing on the computer? You know the rules. No using my equipment without permission. I wasn't on the computer. Yeah, you were. Look, you've changed all the settings. Probably downloaded viruses that'll take forever to fix. Why were you looking at a satellite map of Manchester, New Hampshire? Oh, that. Uh, well, yeah, I was looking for uh, dino mutants, save the world, national security, all that stuff. I don't see any signs of... Whoa! Hold the miniature cell phone. I don't believe I'm going to say this, but you were right, Caruso. Trace elements of primordial ooze. And I'll bet you your last tube of fancy hair gel that where there's primordial ooze, there's going to be dino mutants. Let's go with this bad boy. It sweeps the ooze so you don't have to. It'll pick up any extra primordial ooze that happens to be lying around. That's a good boy. Coochie coochie. Ah! Gross! Get that little guy. It may have ooze on it. Whoa! Look out, gang! Run! Let's put these things on ice. Don't let them get away. My calculations indicate that they're growing at an exponential rate. Go Dino! I'll get him. 
Go Dino! Hang on, little one. Disgusting creature! Go on, little guys. Go play or do whatever it is you do. Yeah, go, go away, nasty things. We should sweep the area for any more primordial ooze or dino mutants. Report in if you find anything. Yo, Caruso. Some place else you need to be? Me? No. No place. I'm fine. Well then, get searching. Let's see. If I go this way and up, should be just around the corner. Ah! It's just me, Caruso. Did you check everything down this way? Absolutely. Did you investigate that dark culvert back there? Well, of course I did. Do you think I'd say I checked if I hadn't checked? I checked! Don't blow a gasket, Caruso. I was just asking. Um, I gotta go check another drain up there. I'll... I'll be right back. Well, unless one of us missed something, I'd say it's all clear. Good work, guys. Wait, where's Caruso? I don't know, but he's acting strange today. It's Caruso. He's always strange. No, today he's being strange even for Caruso. I think we better find him, which will be no problem, thanks to yours truly putting location finders in each of our watches. Geek, and ye shall find. <laughs> Yo, Caruso, what are you doing? Nothing. Who, me? Nothing. Then why are you standing in this line? What line? There isn't any line. The line that stretches all the way around the block? Oh, that line. Yeah, sure. I'm in line. It's, uh, well, it's a blood donor line. I'm standing here to give blood. That's it. It's a blood donor line. I'm giving blood. Whoa. Bad idea, dude. You got dino DNA in your system, remember? You can't donate blood. Right, yeah, well, I wasn't actually planning on donating blood. I was just waiting to see if, if they had any extra cookies and juice for people that were standing in line and wanted some. Look, guys, you can go now and leave me alone because I can positively, absolutely assure you that there is nothing going on here at this theater that you need to worry about. Okay, Caruso, let me get this straight. You're at a theater, last in line of about a thousand people. My calculations indicate given spatial variance and a 5% error ratio that Caruso is last in line of 2,332 people. Just to let you all know, this is the end of the line. Nobody else will be able to audition. For? The you famous TV show. The reality television talent show where anybody can audition and become famous? That's the one. This is as far as the line goes. Caruso, you lied to us. You just looked us in the eyes and lied. Caruso, have you ever heard what Sir Walter Scott said? Oh, what a tangled web we weave. When first we practice to deceive. What does that mean? Tangled web? Like the internet the web? Or... Is it about spiders or something? What it means, Caruso, is that if you lie, it creates the need for more lies and more lies to cover up your original lies until you're caught up in your own web of lies. And it always ends badly for the person doing the lying. Oh. But you don't need to worry. Everything's under control. OK. What are you going to do on stage? I'm, uh, I'm going to sing. <laughs> Experiment 647.23A, continuation. 
Primordial Ooze Batch 017-23 has completely dissipated in strength and faded to nothing. Most vexing. Hmm. Satellite sweeps are picking up a strange ooze signature at the initial location. I'm picking up a possible mutant signature. Turn around, now! I gotta say, I don't remember you ever singing. Not ever. Thank goodness, the end of the line. Wait! No pets allowed. It's okay, he's with us. And he's had all his shots and everything. <sighs> Sorry, I meant the dog. We don't do animal tricks. Look, if you're not auditioning for the You Famous show, you can't be here. Don't wait up, guys. The next time you see me, it's gonna be on TV in front of a crowd of adoring fans. <laughs> Whoa, we've got two alerts. One, seems like we missed a dino mutant. It's on the move. And two, is coming right at us. Victor Velocity! Fiona, get us out of here. Hurry, Fiona, we can't let him see us. Not good, not good. Keep your seatbelt on, Buzz. I'm already on it. We've got to get Caruso out of there. Um, guys? Velocity's parked right in front. Where there's a wheel and overhead satellite photos plus downloaded theater schematics, there's a way. The quickest way in, if you're a dino morphing dino squad, is straight up. Buzz, if you will do the honors. Go dino! an act? I have seen that act a thousand times. Today. Boring! Get off the stage! Get off! I'll definitely be something she's never seen before. A perfectly handsome young man becomes dinosaur? Dinosaur man? Handsome dinosaur man? It's going to be all over the place. Everybody will know me. Fame time. Dino man. Dino. Next! Look, Bobola, in the past few hours, I've been through 2,331 other potential contestants, each more untalented than the last. So you had better knock my proverbial socks off. Huh? Oh, no, not another one. <sighs> oh, right, your socks. Well, you'd better hang on to them because this is going to be something you've never seen before. Here goes. Fame, 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 fame! Caruso, have you ever heard what Sir Walter Scott said? Oh, what a tangled web we weave when first we practice to deceive. Look at that. A spider web. A web. Is that it? You done? Yes. I mean, no. Look, I'm sorry, Ms. Simone. I, I just can't. Obviously, because you... Oh. Yes, you are losing me from your show. That has got to hurt. Um, I know it's heartbreaking, but aren't you overreacting just a little? Sucker's getting big. This should help. Cockroaches can't see in red light.
Thanks, Max. Time to go dino! Over here, there's a big spider web. We can trap him in it. That's holding him. Not surprising. Spider silk has a tensile strength comparable to that of high grade steel. Sweet. An arachnid saurus. Can I keep him? No, Buzz. You cannot keep the mutated spider. It's those perfect dinosaurs. They're. they're here. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta set you guys free. I'd like to keep you as pets, but I don't think that would make my mom too happy. Tell me you got that on videotape. I did! The video camera was running the whole time! It's been erased! But how? <laughs> I left them a little gift on the side of the video camera. An electromagnet. Because as brainiacs like me know, videotape is a magnetic recording. And my magnet just rearranges all the low magnetic sequencing that creates image, or static. Well, I don't understand anything about what just happened. Perhaps I can help. I am a doctor, and I'm afraid I must tell you that all I saw was this fire curtain fall. Must have been loose. There are no such things as monsters or giant cockroaches. I suspect that with the lights and the dark and the long day, you didn't quite see what you thought you saw. It could have been a rare type of fatigue-induced group hypnosis. I'm sorry. Well, I am supposed to be cutting back on coffee. Yes. It's probably something to do with that. Why is it I cannot track those dinosaurs? They don't show up on any of my scans, but they're so perfect. I must find them. I must, wherever they are. I wanted to tell you, I didn't get a chance to sing. Oh, sorry, Caruso, but, you know, that's kind of good because, well, I know it's silly, we thought maybe you were just going to go on that program and go dino, so you could be famous. Well, yeah. That's exactly what I was going to do. See, football? I told you. Now pay up. We bet dessert that you were going to go dino on TV to be famous. Maxi here thought you weren't. Sucker. I didn't, though. I changed my mind at the last minute. I couldn't go through with it. I... I... saw a web. A tangled web. And it made me think about what I was doing. So I didn't. I'm... I'm sorry I lied to you guys. But I've been thinking, maybe I could still be famous. I could learn to sing and be famous. Funny how that's just what Professor Moynihan said when we called and told her all about it. I've been singing for hours. Isn't there an easier way to be famous? If you want to sing, you have to sing. It's just that simple. Mime mamo moo, 
Me a mamo moo. Me me mamo moo. Me me mamo moo. Me me mamo moo. Maybe I'd better call Caruso's parents and tell them he's going to be late for dinner. Dog, the way he sings, he's going to be late for a lot of dinners. I'm in, I'm in, in the Dino Squad. You don't have to be a Dino Squad hero to help save the Earth. Be cool. Reduce, reuse, recycle. Now I try to act normal, keep my cool. After school, I turn into a prehistoric hero. I'm in.